So to start out, let's add our footage, add a new solid layer and name it noise. Now add a gradient ramp to this and add the Tyler effect. Set the scale to around 24%. Now add a Gaussian blur and bump that up to around 70 pixels and tick the repeat edge pixels. Now add a turbulence displace and set the amount to 20. This will give us a nice little wobble on the gradient. Now set the mode to overlay. Let's add an expression to the Tyler center and get the center to move down over time. I found that time times 100 works best. Create a new adjustment layer and name it Displace. Add a displacement map effect and set the displacement layer to read from the noise layer. Make sure to read from the mask and effects too. Play around with the vertical and horizontal displacement till you like it. Now add the reptile effect above the displacement map and set the expand values to be all around 250 and set the tiling mode to unfold. Okay, this effect looks a little over the top, so let's change the tiler scale to something that looks a little nicer. Let's add another adjustment layer, name this scan line and add the Venetian blinds effect. Change the transition completion to around 20%, the direction to 90 degrees. Set the width to 10 and the feather to 5 and you'll get this nice little scan line effect. Now let's add the grain effect. Set the preset to the first one and the viewing mode to final output. Last up, let's change the color. Add the Lumetri color effects, scroll down to the curves, drag the bottom part of the curve up and add a little ramp. Do the same with the red curve. Now let's go and change the temperature to a lower number to cool out the colors. So the last step is optional. I'm just adding some text in here and then putting it below the displace layer. If you're wondering about that expression, I've got another video that covers that. And that's the basic security camera effect. If you have any questions or comments, please leave me a message below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you.